to our new place. We are staying in um, Mumbles, uh, the more beautiful part. And our place is basically antique. That's the theme of the house. So it's from basically from the 60s straight on to the 80s, to the 80s. So yeah, hope you all enjoy. Come. So basically, you got the old 1960s cop cars. And the beauty of it is basically in the kitchen and the rooms. No, I would even say the living room. It's beautiful on the whole, so you see a lot of uh, ancient stuff like this fridge, for instance, come in. It has a little bit of modern touch to it though. Uh, in the kitchen, it has a little bit of modern touch to it. Um, like the uh, partially commercial stove, oven, and stuff like that. Then here, we have the the tumble, the washing, the tumble dryer. A lot of, a lot of, a lot of space. Um, uh, we got the washer. And the view. A lot of stuff to store food and stuff like that. No chandelier. Yes, Microwave, more storage. Yeah. So the view is basically beautiful. But before we go inside the living room, Let's shut on the bedroom because I feel I feel like the beauty is more so out there. So um, being in with that, and I'm not on camera today because I am breaking out terribly. So I do not want to be on camera. <laughs> yeah, my face is terrible. <laughs> we got all the cuddly wine glasses and stuff like that. Uh, tea, tea time, cups and plates, and of course dinner plates. Let's watch ahead. No? Okay. <laughs> <That's pretty good. laughs> yeah. So just a small bathroom. Just just got a little bit of modern touch inside here, like I said. Some things uh is is from the nineteen sixties straight on down, but <laughs> so we up inside here. Look at the shower head. Why is it filled with marbles or whatever this is? That's it's, pre it's pretty cool. Yeah. This is cool. All right, let's go to the bedroom. So, what here again? You wanna come up and then come down? Okay, yeah. Okay, this Skippy room. Yeah, Skippy is paradise, so she would not stop skipping up and down wherever she gotta go. Um, so, this is a little, this, is another, this is another antique chair. Yeah, another antique part. Really antique. Yeah. <laughs> This is another one. So this this remind me of Archie those. <clears throat> but this Dennis the Menace, this go way back. Um, the name of it is the Beano. And this is actually an English piece. Uh, 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 well, not an English piece, a Welsh piece. But yeah. So I guess this is what she was doing. She came in and jumped on the bed, root of the bed. So she was just trying to make it nice and tidy for y'all. So <laughs> this is it. Mm -hmm. This is her little section with her view. Look beautiful around though. Yeah. So that is it. Straight ahead is actually the castle. That's where we... That's the castle? Castle. Yeah. Oh, over there. The castle is there. Oh. Yeah, so we have a lot of... Um, a lot of ancient... Well, historical views from here. And that's... The Gawa, that's the beach area. Well, not the beach, but yeah, nice view. <laughs> so, I think she has to appear. This is a Christmas gift that I got. This, this, she made sure to position this on this chair. Yeah, this, this one of our keepsake. So, she positioned that be on the scene. So, that's bedroom number one. bedroom number two so in here is basically like a nautical room as you can see is a maritime room which I particularly love 
um, and it's infused with a lot of um, antique stuff. It, it's partially antique, partially modern. I like this classic uh, chair. That looks very nice. Classic chair here. Um, it's kind of, it, yeah. This view isn't particularly mm. the best, but yeah. I just like it because you get to go down on the deck area. So, I like the curtain. Yeah, the curtain. Yeah, and I could go outside without going outside. Yeah. <laughs> Basically, climb through the window. So, that's the beauty of that room. And th this room, of course, is the most antique room there yes. is in the house. Um, as you could see, right down to this ivory and wooden um, dresser. Um, I like everything about this room, right down to the chip paint on the wall behind you. Because you actually get a you you, you get that real you get a real touch the real touch of uh, antique. So over here, we have the radio. It actually has a coffee. The coffee uh, maker, which is quite cool. This is a coffee. This is a coffee maker, okay, guys. Or or for you to stay more water. This is very. I I love this. I think that's a lot. Okay. Yeah, and see what happens is, um, it actually pours into this container here. It pours into this container when this gets full and warm. It pours into this container. That's what the nozzle is for, so that you could just pour it straight directly into the cup. So, yeah, this is the setup. Uh, this is the antique radio. Let me see if I can get it to work. With the alarm. Whoa. Okay, light. What Oh, this is a light. Oh, this is basically just a clock then. All right, so that's what this is about. I love this. Some great pieces inside here. Great pieces. And of course, we have the ancient, the very ancient dressing room. So it pulls out and basically, you know, the ladies, the whoever, ladies particular, you just, Get behind you, get dressed, or change your clothes. This is this is very ancient. This is antique. I love it. And this, I wouldn't say this would be my 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 favorite part of this house. Probably the bedroom, and that's it. But I would like it because it's quite close to the heater. And when I need to do my work, I can do so. So yeah, and the chandelier. So I, I love this room. I love it. It has pull-up drawers. It even has pull-up drawers to the bottom. Yep. Pull-up drawers to the bottom. So there you go. He was asking for where the drawers were. Right there. And... Yeah, part is bad. Actually, he has drawers on the gym too. Yeah. This here is a massive storage space. I am afraid to open this because... This is on overload right now. Yeah, we are not opening that. No. So, of course, in every, in all of these homes over here, they are very, very, one thing I can say, they are very regulated. And they adhere to strict regulations, like um, the powder um, fire hydrant. But I think the, the fire hose. was the same thing too, though. Everywhere got out of them. Yeah, but everywhere one. doesn't. Everywhere doesn't. So, but they, they, they quite strip. Yeah, so we have a fridge going on. I so, said, no, what's it? He said, no. So I guess you have to go to the store and do whatever she needs to do. Um, I don't like to shop, guys. I would prefer to give money. I don't like to shop at all. So, Coming to my favorite part, my most favorite part of the house is basically 
city, the living room. And I will... Excuse us just a quick second. Apart from the view and the couch, the, the bottom in itself, um, everything, like I said, this is the most antique part of the house. Um, as you can see, ancient telephones. And it quite works. It works. So, I don't know how old this phone is, but trust me, this can get a pretty penny. This ancient radio. Robert, with the antenna. Yes, it works. Okay, I stand up. I'm absolutely shocked. I don't even know what to say, but thank you so much. Thank you, guys. Sport, and in the last few minutes, so, Cardiff Blues have confirmed the news. And over here, we got the ancient can. Well, I don't even know if this is a candle, but it's quite ancient. The lava lamp. And we have marbles, guys. I haven't played marbles for my job, but we have two glass filled with marbles. <laughs> um, these books, these are basically uh, Christmas stories, ancient Christmas stories. <laughs> Ancient Christmas stories. Centennial edition. Whoa. Okay. This was from 16. This book is from 16. Printed from 1967. So, yeah. You can tell from the from the from the writing in the book. You can actually tell. Okay, so here, here we have, first of all, this, a record player. This is a record player. So, <laughs> this I have to buy, I have to power up, I don't know, I have to find a power plug, but that is actually, yeah. So we have some old discs here by, um, Rod Stewart, apparently, um, whoever was here, they, they, they loved it. So, let me just go ahead and pop this on. Ah. Look at the paper of this. Look, 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 at the, look at the paper itself. You could tell that this is quite old, but it's well kept. Um, yeah, guys, like I said, I have to go and get the power cord for it. So right now this won't be spinning, but it kind of goes like that. Yeah, so we have that. We have, uh, let's look at a few others. We have Bay City Rollers, if you're familiar with it. More Rod Stewart. More Rollers. Uh, who is this? Status Quo, Blue For You. Superstars. More status quo. More status quo. Oh, who's this? Status quo. So yeah, you, you they seem to be quite popular uh, back in those days. So you, you get a lot of Rod Stewart, of course, The Last Dance. Yeah, a lot of ancient stuff. A lot of antique, antique CDs, antique. Oh, that should tell you all something, modern. Antique um, discs. Or records. Listen, I would hate to be buying these and lugging these around, honestly. But let's not destroy this. Yeah, so that's basically um, that's that's basically it as far as you know antique goes. Um, a lot of draw, a lot of space down here for storage, and. Down here, we have a lot of a lot of games down here as well. We have Ludo um, cards, Trouble the World, um, Trivial Pursuit, Lord of the Rings. 
uh, Monopoly and Downfall. So a lot of, of board games here as well. So, and lastly, the view. So it's quite a tight knit community down this way. They're more village life and um, everybody basically knows everybody. As we rolled in, everybody just started to look and was in awe and started to wonder like, okay, who is this? Um, one thing I like about down here is that everybody is really, really nice. You know, they'll look out for you and um, that's just who they are. They're, they're generally nice people down here in Wales, the Welsh are nice. Don't get it mixed up. Don't call them British. Don't call them English. They are Welsh. So they are part of the UK, but they are Welsh. Um, but they are quite pleasant people. And we're going to be moving on to um, Leeds quite soon. Uh, bigger city in Leeds and that's in England and I'm quite kind of concerned about you know um, adapting to the environment down there and how uh, the people what the people would be like and if they are going to be as warm as the the Welsh so we particularly love this area because um, in Wales we love Wales on the whole because it's more it's, it's more homely they have beaches and the people like I said the people are, are much they, they warm they are very welcoming and um, that's one thing that we particularly like about down here is chill, it's laid back, it's conducive for learning and um, it's a nice place to raise your kids, really. So moving to Eglin in a much bigger city and, uh, you know, yeah, quite, quite worried about that. So we'll see how it goes in about a few months. So that's it. This is our home and yeah, thank you. Thank you for, sh for, for, for sh sharing our welcoming party. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. So, so that is the end. That is the end of the new apartment tour. Yeah, sure. I did. Yeah, I yeah. did. I'll show you guys so, outside again. Yeah. So that's our view for now, guys. I'll be having plenty of coffee here in the zone. And uh, thank you for... Thank you for thank watching. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'll see you guys on the next video. Ta-da!